Yeah. yeah. For starch, we took the iodine uh, midget and put three to five drops in it and it turned black after a few seconds. For glucose, we did the same thing. But after we put the drops in it, we put the test tube in the heating beaker and it turned to orange. All right, the hot water bath, okay. And for protein, same thing, and it turned purple afterwards. Okay, so you can now can identify what a positive starch glucose protein test looks like. So next week, you're gonna to have to be able to apply this to an unknown lab where it's gonna say A, B, and C, and you're gonna to have to do the starch glucose protein on all three samples. So after you do cleanup, you guys start talking about how you're gonna work that out, how you're gonna plan that up.